We are so excited to present to you our keynote speakers. We have five incredible students from Maynard New Technology High School all the way in Texas who drove 15 hours to share their experiences with you on how PBL has changed their education and how they are so passionate about it. So please welcome students from Maynard New Tech High School. Uh, hi guys, my name is Alexander Adams. I am going to be a junior at Maynard New Tech High School. Hi, I'm Irvin Abarca, and I'm going to be a junior this year at uh, New Tech. I'm Mackenzie Mobley, and I'm going to be a senior this year. I'm Marita Henley, and I'm also going to be a senior this year. I'm Boye Coleman, and I'm also going to be a senior this year. So this is our PBL experience, and we have a short video we'd like to show you before we get started with our speaking. So my favorite part of PBL learning is that it sometimes takes the workload off of trying to do five projects at the same time. You can collaborate with your group and get things done faster. One of the things that you have to learn in New Tech is collaborating with other people. I really hated that at the beginning of my freshman year. I hated that my grade was dependent on the work that other people did. So throughout the months that I worked, I learned to trust people and um, collaborate more with them. <coughs> So at the end, we could have a, a good final product, product and get a good grade for it. So the culture at New Tech is very unique. Um, the teachers here are more like mentors other than teachers, and they actually care a lot about you getting your work done. They're very motivational, and they always try to get you to do your best. The school culture really helps our school when we're collaborating in our groups because we can really work well together and our stuff can be trusted. As we, if we set it down and we go somewhere else to work on you know, something and it'll take us like 15 minutes, we can trust that our stuff will still be there and uh, we can trust that our group members will help us out and watch our backs whenever we go out to do something. And uh, whenever, we, whenever we work on a group project, then uh, our group members will help us out and help us without getting in our arguments. I've kind of had an issue working with others because I can be kind of a dictator, but New Tech has taught me to play to other people's strengths. If somebody works very slow, I can give them a task that has to be too later on. And I've also learned to step back and let somebody else lead instead of me being a leader all the time. And it's just really nice to work with different types of people and work play to their strength. I think that New Tech helped me be better prepared for college by the workload. The workload was a lot at some times. And I figured out how to manage it and I figured out how to take care of it all without being overwhelmed. And also with the style of teaching, I will be able to, to adapt to college learning better with the way I was taught here. The difference between our high school and a regular high school is that you develop the real world skills. And what I mean by that is that you're collaborating with others to turn in a final product. In that final product, you have to work with the team to make it great. You are giving a certain amount of time. And during 
that time, you have to time manage, you have to plan out what goes to that person or when is that going to be done by them. And also you have way more responsibility. Are you here with me? Just looking out on the day of another dream. So, as we said before, we are Maynard New Technology High School. We're located in Maynard, Texas. That's right outside of Austin, if you don't know where that is. And we were established in 2007, and we've been going strong since. We, uh, we've been nationally ranked and recognized by U.S. News Education. We were given a uh, medal, kind of, for the, recogni the recognition. Okay, hi guys, good morning. Um, my name is Alexander Adams. I am going to be a junior. So I'm gonna be talking about how PBL has influenced my learning, my high school learning experience. The first thing I'd like to talk about is the improved social skills. Going to New Tech, you pretty much are forced to work with people every day. Even if you like them, <laughs> even if you don't like them, <laughs> even if you don't know them, especially freshman year, that was a little <laughs> awkward. But um, you eventually get to know them, but they become your family. But you also, you just learn to collaborate. You learn to, like, let's say I'm working in a project with Irving, right? And he's like, hey, should we make the PowerPoint red or blue? However you want it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's just kind of you start to work with people a lot better. And then time management. That's a really big one because you are going to high school. You do take multiple courses at the same time. And you don't just get one project for all the subjects. You have a separate project for each class. And so you have to learn to manage your time. You say, like, I'm going to spend an hour on this poster, two hours on this video. And especially because I am a um, woodwind section leader for the band. So balancing band and that was a very big thing to have to do. Um, and then for creativity, you, you, you get to be really creative with what you do. Because when you get there, originally, all you think is like, all right, so I go to New Tech. I'm going to be making like a ton of PowerPoints. And yeah. But recently, we had a project where we had to create a new bike. Um, and our teacher said, OK, you guys can do whatever you want, but just as long as you present the information. So me and my group were like, hey, guys, let's make a trailer for the bike. So we went into iMovie. We made like this really epic trailer, made the bike look really cool. And that was our presentation. And then after that, we just kind of got up there. And no PowerPoint, nothing like that. We just explained our information and how it like applied to our bike. And yeah, that's PBL in learning. <laughs> then here's Irving. OK, so I'm Irving, as I already told you. And I'm going to be a junior this year. And I'm going to be straight up with y'all, like, since the beginning. And <laughs> when I was a freshman, I really didn't want to go to New Tech. Like, it was my parents chose it for me. And at the beginning, I was, like, really mad about it. I was, like, uh, like finding ways to get out to school and stuff like that. <laughs> and during that time, I actually had a problem. Like, uh, I disrespected the school culture, and I got sent away to an alternative school for about 30 days. And at that time, I was, like, well, I really didn't want to be at that school, but I didn't want to, like, I didn't want it to be them that didn't want me, you know? So, <laughs> <laughs> so that whole time I was over there, I just thought about everything I did, and, like, I saw the teachers would come, like, to, they would, like, drive all the way to that alternative school, even though they didn't have to, because they could email me. The whole time I was over there, I was just reflecting on myself. They would actually motivate me. They would be like, Look, I know this happened, like, you're, you're, you're still young, like, this happens to a lot of kids.